Hello everyone, thanks so much for stopping by. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how we make shrimp tostadas in my house. So we're gonna start by slicing a pound and a half of shrimp. And I say we, I'm being very generous. My husband's the one that's doing the shrimp tostadas, but he's just dicing those shrimp. The next ingredient is gonna be a large cucumber. So just peel it and we're peeling it so we could cut it in slices. And I'm gonna be using, oh, I'm gonna be using, there I go again, my husband's gonna be using a little machine. That's why we have to cut the pieces in, in smaller pieces so they could fit into the little machine. So we're using the bottom top of the little dicer and you're just gonna place the dicer on top and just start hitting the top and that cuts it into smaller little pieces. Now if you don't have this, you could definitely do it by hand, but it does take a lot longer. So once you're done, it just leaves it into tiny little perfect pieces. The next ingredient is gonna be carrots. So you're gonna do the same thing, or we're doing the same thing, uh, just cutting it in slices so it could fit into the little machine. And it's time to just hit the top, and this is a very loud little machine. Um, if you have something else, maybe a little, I don't know, I'm sure they have electronic ones as well, so we're just adding the carrots to the mix. The next ingredient is going to be a tomato. And this tomato, um, all you need is one. And Jaime, my husband's gonna be taking, removing the little seeds, but this isn't a necessary step. He just doesn't like adding it. These, we cannot add them to the little machine because it'll like mash it up. So he's just dicing these into little pieces. The next thing is a large chile jalapeño, removing the seeds. And this one is gonna go into the little machine. So just cutting it into smaller pieces so it could fit nicely in there. The next ingredient is cilantro. I love cilantro. This really helps you get rid of that extra water you're carrying in your body. I, and that's not why I love it. I love the smell, I love the taste, and this is the next ingredient. Just add it to the mixture. The next ingredient is going to be a half of an onion. This one is gonna go into the little machine, so he's just cutting it into smaller little pieces. And now it's just time to add it to the mixture. Next, we're going to be cutting five lemons and just adding that good citrusy taste to the mixture. The smell is just amazing. Now it's time to add salt. Just add salt to taste. And you're gonna do the same exact thing with pepper. Now the fun part, the mixing part. Oh my goodness, you guys, you should smell this. It just smells amazing. If you give this a try, you're just gonna go crazy for the smell. It's just a perfect meal for summer. It's nice and fresh and it just tastes amazing. If you feel like tasting a citrusy sort of taste, the salty citrusy, this is perfect. I hope you guys give these a try. If you do, let me know. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.